Now this might go down as one of the oddest stories of all. Officials in a central Chinese province have been told that they and all of their agencies, all the way down to school districts, need to smoke more. They need to smoke local cigarettes to help boost the economy. While China as a nation grapples with smoking, they have 350 million smokers estimated and an average of 1 million people a year die from smoking related illnesses. Government telling government employees to smoke more. <laughs> okay, <laughs> can we talk to someone above you in regards to this one issue? And the French, in a recent study of habitual behavior, have been found to sleep more and eat more than any other wealthy nation in terms of time. The, I'm going to move to France. The French on average sleep eight and a half hours a night and spend over two hours a day eating and drinking. That's like 12 hours a day between the almost nine in sleep and the two and a half or so in eating and drinking spent increasing their longevity. I don't know if you deduct the sleeping and the eating hours, I don't know if they really do live that much longer. I was surprised to find out that the United States of America is number three on the hours of sleep. An average of eight and a half hours. Who's getting that much sleep out there? <laughs> Nobody I know. Spain coming in behind the United States. <laughs> you think the siesta thing would work out for them? My unusual findings in a worldwide study. I say, eat a lot, sleep a lot, brush them like crazy, run a lot, do a lot, never be lazy. Ooh, name that tune.